Amplitube and Audio Bus, perfect together. Audio Bus lets you use multiple apps together, and IK Multimedia's Amplitube is the perfect app for many different Audio Bus applications. Amplitube works great in all three Audio Bus slots, but naturally it excels in the input slot where you can record into your device using its amazing amp and effects models. Here in AudioBus's main screen, I'll tap the input icon, choose Amplitude from the list, then I'll tap the output icon and select Harmonic Dog's Multitrack DAW app. Once you have an output set, you'll see the flashing arrows light up to show that the apps are connected. You don't even have to go back to Multitrack DAW to start recording. We just press the icon beneath it that shows up in the little audio bus control bar in all the connected apps. And there's its recording controls. I've got my guitar plugged in through IK's iRig adapter and I'm ready to record. You can have up to three simultaneous inputs with audio bus. Let's get a couple going here. First I'll open the Rebirth app from Propellerhead and start the drums playing. I have Amplitube in AudioBus's output slot this time. Notice that I have its amp turned off. I'm just using it as an effects processor at the moment. I'll adjust the envelope filter in real time to get some really cool effects. And if I want to, I can open up Amplitube's multi-track recorder and start recording. Now I'll use a second input slot to open IMS20, a cool synth app from Korg. I'll use it for a bass line, which I'll play using IK Multimedia's iRig Keys, the ultra-portable universal MIDI controller. And here's a little tip when using Audio Bus. You can make the little Audio Bus control bar go away by just giving it a little push with your finger. Then just tap on the side of the screen and you'll see the little tab and you can open it up again. So there you have it. Amplitude and Audio Bus. The possibilities are endless. <laughs>